The Road to Emmaus For I know the plans I have for you, says the Lord. They are plans for good and not for disaster, to give you a future and a hope. Jeremiah chapter 23 verse 11 Have you found yourself on the wrong road going in the wrong direction? Do you feel that all hope is gone? Take courage from disciples who traveled to Emmaus with heavy hearts. Two disciples were not able to believe testimony from the women who had found an empty tomb and heard from angels that Jesus is alive. They turned their backs on the last place where they have been with Jesus and walked back to their former life in Emmaus. Luke records the road to Emmaus is about 7 miles from Jerusalem, but researchers do not know the exact location. Since the disciples seem to have arrived home together to prepare a meal, scholars believe the unnamed disciple is the wife of Cleopas. She joins a long list of unnamed women mentioned in the Bible. Read Luke chapter 24 verse 13 to 25 to discover how the Savior gives the woman a future and a hope on that sorrowful morning when she cannot see Him. Jesus walks with you even if no one knows your name. The unrecognized Jesus moves close enough to overhear the distress of the couple. Filled with concern, he engages them without an introduction. He walks for miles, giving them his full attention. Even if you feel like a nobody, you are the most important person in the world to Jesus. He never ignores you and always accepts your invitation. He is available for the sinful woman to anoint his feet. He does not judge the woman caught in adultery. He eats with unnamed publicans and prostitutes. Jesus walks with you no matter where you are. You may be walking to nowhere, to a place that isn't on the map, but Jesus shows up for you. You may not recognize him, but he is your companion the entire journey, no matter how far you go before detecting his presence. Jesus walks with you to remind you who you are. The two disciples think they have reached their dead-end destination, but then they recognize Jesus and notice their burning heart suddenly aware that they are not fulfilling their purpose as his disciples, they return in a rush to Jerusalem, overjoyed to share their story of hope and to begin writing another chapter of life. If you are walking down the wrong road, invite Jesus to walk with you. He knows where you are. He will remind you who you are, where you are going, and why you need to get there. As told by Juan Cortez to Rebecca Turner. So, what do you think about this story? Comment down below and let's share your thoughts.